Healthy childhood development is closely tied to neurological factors. In today's Health Matters, we find out how a local hospital is helping children treat and manage their neurological conditions. Sometimes, neurological disorders can interfere with the child's natural development. That's why the Children's Hospital of Southwest Florida treats a wide range of neurological disorders, including epilepsy and ADHD. I do see a lot of, of children that do have uh, seizure disorders, that have migraines, uh, different types of, of headaches, um, any particular neurological problem from back pain to, to numbness. Um, there's, there's also a lot of uh, ADHD that I do see, and I do a lot of evaluation for children with uh, neurodevelopmental disabilities. Children throughout Southwest Florida are fortunate that they don't have to travel far to see a specialist. That makes the testing and treatment process a little easier on the entire family. It's important because in the, in the hospital setting, when a kid does have uh, a neurologic problem, such as seizures, for example, if you don't have a pediatric neurologist, then a lot of these kids need to be sent to a place that actually does have a, a pediatric neurologist. A neurological disorder can affect a child's ability to develop normally. That's why early diagnosis is so important. Reporting for Lee Memorial Health System, I'm John Bafar. A wide range of management and treatment options are available depending on each child's unique needs.